I'm Jim Taylor, and we're at my garage, which is an assemblage of classic and vintage cars, going from 1911 up to newer cars. My name is Ian Kelleher. I'm the Chief Marketing Officer for Broad Arrow Auctions and Broad Arrow Group. Hi, I'm Donnie Gould. I'm with Broad Arrow Auctions, and we're here in Gloversville, New York, with Jim Taylor's fabulous car collection. Broad Arrow Group is a relatively new auction company. However, we're represented by a group of car specialists with over 100 years of industry experience. We're really caretakers for a period of time, and at some point, they pass on to new caretakers. Passion for the drive, the cars of Jim Taylor, represents cars of every era, every value. Jim Taylor is a driver, and he loves driving cars. So included in this sale are some modern vehicles, Ford GTs, Aston Martins, and BMWs. The Ford GTs, when they came out, in the early 2000s were interesting to me because of the story behind them and they're based on the racing GTs back in the day. One of my favorite cars in Jim Taylor's collection is his 2003 Aston Martin DBAR1, which is a Zagato bodied example, one of 99 originally built. 12 cylinder power, six speed manual transmission and this particular car that Jim is selling has bespoke features on it. The attraction of some of the newer cars, in some ways it was opportunistic. The 928 GT, a friend of mine bought that new, and he decided to sell it a few years later, and I had driven it a couple of times, so I bought it from him, I never looked back. That's been part of the collection from its inception. 850 CSI BMW, V12, six-speed transmission, very rare US car. The SL65 Black Series is, of course, a newer car. It's a 2008, and that's one of the quickest cars in the garage, if not the quickest. It is brutally fast. <laughs> Man, this thing got sideways quick. Holy shit. <laughs> Jim's collection also has trucks in it as well, and one of his favorite trucks is his Dodge Military Power Wagon. I've been interested in power wagons over the years. Unfortunately, I don't fit very well in them, but Donnie knew I was interested in it, and one time he called me up and says, I just bought you a car. I said, well, what's that, Donnie? And he said, I bought you a military uh, Korean War era power wagon. Within the Jim Taylor collection, there are uh, there's a strong representation of what we would call classics. It's something like uh, Mercedes-Benz 300 SL, which is uh, this particular one was a 1961, so a very late production car. Uh, I love driving the 300 SL. It's a unique car. It's kind of almost perfection for that era. I've taken it on several rallies and just had a lot of fun. It's one, it's one of the cars I just like to take and drive up here through the mountains and on a nice day and ramp it up and go with it. Well, I had a number of friends that had Bugattis, and I thought I'd like to have one, so I started looking around, and I put quite a bit of money into it to do some good mechanical work on it. One of the cars I really like is the 1954 Cunningham C3. It was a car he bought unrestored and then executed the restoration, uh, which he's done on a number of cars, and that really is, that is a collector's commitment in many ways. He's got a 1931 Cadillac that belonged to his father, and that car has been with the Taylor family for decades. Um, it's a very rare 12-cylinder Sport Phaeton model, and it's restored to national prize-winning standards. I was feeling somewhat apprehensive when I made the decision to, uh, uh, to sell the cars that are a significant uh, part of my estate. I'd walk into the garage and say, the hell with it, I'm not gonna sell any of them. And my kids can deal with it, but when I became a little more rational. I'm pretty much at peace with doing it. The Passion for the Drive, the Cars of Jim Taylor auction will take place this October, October 14th and 15th. We'll open for preview on Monday the 10th. If you're interested in becoming a bidder, you can go to our website at broadarrowauctions.com and you can register to bid there or you can call us directly at the number that's listed on the website. I hope you all come to Glovers in October and visit our garage and have some fun, like they say, bring money and bid high. <laughs>